The prominent German carmaker Audi AAG introduced the Audi A3, a subcompact executive or small family car, into production in September 1996. The Audi A3, which is currently in its fourth generation, has established itself as a popular vehicle in the marketplace throughout time. Whether you're a proud owner or just a fan of this sleek and stylish model Audi A, 38V generation, 2012 to 2020, to be well informed is essential. Today, we're diving deep into the world of Audi, specifically the A38V generation, spanning from 2012 to 2020. Now we know how much you love your Audi A3, but every vehicle has its quirks, right? So buckle up, hit that like button, and let's embark on a journey to know your Audi A3 like never before. The initial two iterations of the Audi A3 undoubtedly performed well, offering sophisticated automobiles to consumers who would have otherwise chosen a Volkswagen Golf or a high-end Ford Focus. However, this vintage's A3s are a little boring. With the introduction of the MK3, officially called the 8V mode, which was opulent and enjoyable, it all changed. Though Audis are renowned for being excellent automobiles, the A3 isn't flawless and is known to have a few frequent issues. Although Audi repair shops may charge astronomical prices to restore your A3, you may really save a ton of money simply taking out a few spanners and doing the work yourself. Engine problems. First up, let's talk about engine issues. Some Audi A3 owners have reported issues with the 1.8T and 2.0T engines, such as oil consumption and carbon buildup. Regular oil changes and using high quality oil can help prevent these problems. Additionally, periodic carbon cleaning can keep your engine running smoothly. Drivers of Audi A3 vehicles have experienced engine issues, which in certain circumstances have resulted in the engine failing completely. Some owners reported problems with the timing chain tensioner, which can lead to timing chain wear and potentially result in engine damage. Some Audi A3 owners have reported higher than normal oil consumption. It's crucial to monitor the oil levels regularly and address any significant consumption issues promptly to avoid potential engine damage. Direct injection engines, including those in the Audi A3, may experience carbon buildup on the intake valves over time. This can affect engine performance and fuel efficiency. Coolant leaks have been reported in some instances. These leaks can lead to overheating issues and potential engine damage. Regularly check the coolant levels and inspect for any signs of leaks. Failures in the PCV system can lead to various issues, including increased oil consumption and poor engine performance. Regular inspections and addressing any PCV system problems promptly are recommended. How to spot it? This issue can present with a variety of symptoms, such as smoking exhaust, and illuminated engine management light, and poor fuel efficiency. Sadly, there are many possible causes of engine issues. If you've seen any of these signs, your Audi A3 probably has engine issues and needs to be examined by a professional. Gearbox issues. Additionally, several drivers have stated that their Audi A3's gearbox is having problems, making the gear changes stiff. Fluid levels may decline as a result of leaks in the transmission system, which may result in shifting problems and possible long-term damage. Issues with automatic gearboxes might include jerky shifting, delayed engagement, or improper shifting. Over time, the gearbox's mechanical parts may wear down and cause problems including grinding noises, shifting difficulties, or gear failure. How to spot it? It may become harder to move your gear stick into the proper gear as a result of your gear linkage being more prone to normal wear and tear over time. Transmission fluid leaks, thumping noises, and grinding noises are some more signs of gear linkage issues. It should go without saying that gearbox issues are crucial to the proper operation of your automobile in addition to being annoying when you're driving. Clutch problems. Another issue that owners of the Audi A3 have reported is with the clutch. A malfunctioning clutch is frequently the source of the power loss that some drivers have noticed happening to their Audi while driving. Some owners have reported premature wear of the clutch, leading to issues such as slipping or difficulty engaging gears. This can be influenced by driving habits, 
but if the wear seems excessive, it may be worth investigating further. Juddering or vibrations during clutch engagement or disengagement can be a sign of clutch problems. This may be caused by issues with the clutch disc, pressure plate, or flywheel. Problems with the hydraulic system, such as a leaking clutch master or slave cylinder, can result in difficulty shifting gears or a soft or spongy clutch pedal. Unusual noises during clutch operation, such as squeaks or rattles, could indicate issues with the clutch components or the release bearing. Some A3 owners have reported issues with the dual mast flywheel, which can lead to vibrations or rattling sounds. If the DFF fails, it may require replacement. Leaks in the clutch hydraulic system can lead to a loss of fluid and subsequent clutch performance issues. Common sources of leaks include the master and slave cylinders. How to spot it? Acceleration is lost when your car's clutch is worn out or malfunctioning because the clutch disc cannot hold the flywheel down as strongly as it should. To have your automobile fixed, look for a specialized shop or technician if your car is losing power or you are experiencing clutch issues. Starting issues. Additionally, some drivers have reported having trouble starting their Audi A3. Some owners have reported issues with ignition coil failure, leading to rough idling, misfires, and poor performance. Like any car, the A3 can experience battery problems over time. Weak or dead batteries may cause starting issues. Malfunctions with the starter motor can result in difficulty starting the engine. Issues with the fuel pump can cause starting problems and affect the overall performance of the vehicle. Faulty ignition switches may lead to intermittent starting problems or complete failure to start. Some owners have reported problems with the key fob, such as difficulty in recognizing the key or problems with the electronic immobilizer system. Issues with fuel injectors can result in poor fuel delivery, affecting the starting and running of the engine. How to spot it? If the engine management light is on and your car is having trouble starting, there may be an issue with the engine coolant sensors, insufficient fuel pressure, or the engine ignition. Getting your car's starting issues diagnosed by a qualified professional is the only reliable approach to find out what's wrong. Suspension problems. Some owners have reported issues with the strut mounts and bearings, leading to clunking or knocking noises when going over bumps. Inspecting these components for wear and tear is crucial. Shock absorbers may develop leaks over time, affecting their performance. Look for signs of oil leakage around the shock absorbers and check for any uneven tire wear, as it could be an indicator of suspension issues. Warm control arm bushings can result in imprecise handling and poor ride quality. If you notice excessive play or movement in the wheels when the car is jacked up, it could be a sign of worn control arm bushings. Some owners have reported issues with the front suspension springs breaking or becoming damaged. A visual inspection of the springs for any signs of cracks or damage is recommended. Faulty stabilizer bar links can lead to rattling or knocking sounds when driving over uneven surfaces. Inspect these links for any play or wear. How to spot it? Pay attention to unusual noises, such as clunks, rattles, or knocks when driving over bumps. Check for uneven tire wear as it can indicate alignment or suspension issues. Inspect the suspension components visually for any signs of damage, leaks, or excessive wear. Take note of any changes in handling, such as increased body roll or a less responsive steering feel. Due to a few of these issues, Audi has announced recalls. Recalls of the Audi A38V have happened sometimes, but not frequently. A recall was issued for a few vehicles due to a potential for the passenger airbag to malfunction. Then, since a malfunctioning camshaft adjustment belt pulley may fail and have a major impact on the longevity of the engine, another recall was necessary. After, a small number of A3 models were recalled due to rear hub carriers not meeting minimum standards, Many vehicles were recalled due to two different problems with the rear head restraints. That's it. As we previously said, the A3 hasn't been recalled very frequently. We hope this information helps you navigate any issues with confidence. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more insightful content, as well as hit the bell icon to stay updated. And we'll see you guys in our next video.